Hello, chess lovers. I have another mega aggressive attacking game for you, played by the fourth world chess champion Alexander Alyokhin against a chess player named Gonsiorovsky. This was a blindfold chess simul played in 1918 in Odessa. Gonsiorovsky started with e4 and e5 by Alyokhin, bishop c4, white goes for bishop's opening, knight f6, d3 and c6, black is preparing to establish a strong center center, queen e2 and bishop e7. Well actually d5 is also a player, but though in the end of the day white is winning the pawn on e5 square, but of course black is getting a compensation for the sacrificed pawn. Black will then castle kingside, kick away the queen, no problem at all. But instead after queen e2 we first see bishop e7, f4 and only now we see d5. He takes d5, he takes f4, bishop takes f4, black castles kingside and knight d2. A very passive square for white knight, actually placing the knight on c3 square would have been better if c takes d5 then bishop b3, but instead after castling kingside we see knight d2, here comes c takes d5 and after bishop b3, if we have a look at this white knight, the knight on d2 stands awkwardly, a5 and c3, white is playing very passively, actually playing bishop a4 or a4, stopping the pawn's further advancement would have been better, but after a5 we see c3, a4, bishop c2, and the a pawn marches forward once again, a3, b3, rook e8, white castles queenside. Here comes bishop b4, both attacking the pawn and also the queen, queen f2, and bishop takes c3, bishop g5, knight c6, knight f3, and d4. Another strong move by Alyokhin, both strengthening the bishop on c3 square and also freeing this d5 square for black knight. Rook e1, bishop b2 check, king b1, and now as you can see the knight on f6 square is pinned, but Alyokhin plays a fantastic knight d5. But the queen can't be touched because of this knight c3 checkmate. Look at this. Though this was a blindfold simul, but Alyokhin sees everything. We see rook takes e8 check, queen takes e8, knight e4, covering the c3 square. And now you can pause the video and try to find black's next move. Ready? Alyokhin simply captured on e4, removing the defender again. d takes e4 leads to this checkmate. After queen takes e4, we see bishop d2 covering the c3 square, but this angry queen is not even going to retreat. Queen e3, look at this. What's going on? Now if queen takes e3, then simply d takes e3, if bishop e1, then e2, it's over, this is just crushing, and of course bishop takes e3 again, can't be played because of this checkmate. After queen e3, white played rook e1, but again, this angry queen is not retreating. Alokhin played bishop f5. Finally, white accepted the queen's sacrifice, rook takes e3. Here comes the pawn, d takes e3, queen f1, e takes d2. This is not a chess game, Alokhin is playing checkers. Right now the threat is again checkmate in one, bishop d1 freeing c2 square for white king to escape. But now comes the second knight, knight b4, covering the c2 square and white can't avoid this knight c3 checkmate, queen e2 and we see knight c3 checkmate on the board. Look at this fantastic position. What a game. If you enjoy this brilliant attacking game, don't forget to give the thumbs up or subscribe to my channel, more games are coming. Good luck.